Gentlemen, welcome back. Welcome back to Midtown Money. Today's topic, why are you walking past thousands of dollars? Before we get to that, thank you to the ongoing support to the Patreon investors in this channel, as well as those men that bought me a cup of coffee based upon the last video via PayPal. Men, see the video description today. Become a Patreon supporter of this channel. Let's get on to today's topic about men walking by thousands of dollars. You know, I don't know, some of you must be extremely wealthy or at least independently wealthy based upon some of the comments that I see, in particular the pushback I get when I mention about giving till it hurts regarding your 401k plan. Of course, I'm speaking to Americans because, of course, they represent about four out of five of viewers on this channel. However, I encourage all international viewers to make sure that you understand your retirement plan. Your company probably has some sort of retirement plan in your particular country, and inevitably it has all types of nuances and complications, etc. And there is evidently a great deal of ignorance based upon the comments about Americans and how to best utilize and make money from their 401k plans. So today I'm going to give you the straight scoop as much as I can, the facts, emphasize the facts about your 401k plan and how you can really make money from it. Let's start with number one. This is critically important, men. Look, based upon 2018's new tax brackets, new tax tables, etc., you can make more money than ever before in contributing and maxing out your 401k. I'm going to give you a real-life example that I use based upon a calculator. I'll include the link to the calculator that you can see for yourself exactly what I'm talking about. If you're a single man earning a W-2 income, in other words, you got a regular job, you get a W-2 at the end of the year, and you have no kids, and you're taking a standard deduction, I used a hypothetical that you're making $50,000. Simple math, $50,000. That puts you in the new 22% tax bracket in the United States. Based upon this calculator, you will pay $4,370 in taxes on your $50,000 of income. Pretty simple. However, if you had chosen to do what I suggest and to max out your 401k for 2018 and put in the maximum, and this year is $18,500, you would pay, instead of that $4,070, you would pay $2,150. So in other words, men, oh, that's right, you would have saved 50% on your taxes. In other words, you automatically would have saved over $2,000 in taxes if you had simply followed this one single suggestion that I said, which of course was max out your 401k. You would have gone from the 22% tax bracket to the 12% tax bracket. So already, you've pocketed $2,000 straight in your bank account. Next, most companies, I did not say all, but most companies within the United States have some sort of match for your 401k program. Now, of course, I understand this varies from company to company in terms of the formula that they use, etc. But I'm, again, just using simple example, let's say that they match up to the first dollar for dollar up to $2,000. So let's say, again, hypothetically, you only put in $2,000 into your 401k and your company matches $2,000. What's your return on your investment? You've put in $2,000. They put in $2,000. Oh, you've got a 100% return guaranteed on your money. Good luck finding another investment that'll give you a guaranteed 100% return on your money. So again, at the very least, at the very minimal, you should put in the maximum you can get to get the match out of your company. So you can get that 100% gain on your money. Next, another myth that keeps coming up that I keep seeing feedback is, oh, well, I'm afraid of putting my money into the 401k because I don't want to put it in the stock market because everyone knows the stock market is going to crash tomorrow. Again, this is a myth. I presume, I can almost guarantee you that your 401k plan has what's called a money market fund option. So in other words, Every dollar that you put into your 401k can go into a money market fund. 
A money market fund, men, is essentially a bank account. It's essentially a savings account. Your money is not going anywhere. It's all about preservation of capital. There's basically no risk. This is not putting into the stock market if you put your money into a money market fund. You put in $2,000, you're going to end up with $2,000 12 months later plus a slight amount of interest. All right, next, another myth that I keep seeing is, and this one is particularly widespread, is that, oh, well, I can't get my money for years. I need to be retired. I need to be 59 and a half or 65 or whatever to get up my money. No, no, and no. This is a total myth. Let me give you three ways that applies for many of you relative to getting your money prior to retirement. All right, one, many 401k plans have a loan option. In other words, you can borrow money from the 401k, from the money that you've put in, and use it for some other reason that you might want to. Let's say you need to buy a car. Let's say you want to pay off credit card debt, etc. So I'm just going to use an easy example. Let's say through the past couple of years, you've contributed $10,000 into your 401k. It is not uncommon that there would be some sort of method that you could take a loan from your 401k plan of the money you've contributed, that $10,000, you could borrow, for example, $5,000, and you in turn could use that money to go ahead and pay off something, pay off a credit card debt, etc. And guess what? You pay no penalty for this. You simply pay the money back into your 401k. In other words, it's a loan from yourself to pay something else. All right, two, you can also, again, penalty free, take money out of your 401k per the IRS if you're buying your first home. Yes, if you're buying your first home, you can take the money out penalty-free per the IRS. A third option, once again, a lot of men need to hear this one clearly. If you leave your employer, you can, of course, roll over. In other words, just physically do some paperwork and transfer over your 401k plan after you've left your employer to what's called an IRA, an individual retirement account. At any age, you can start taking withdrawals from your IRA penalty free. So let me hear it. Let me say it again, just in case you're not listening closely. You can start taking money out at any age from your IRA plan if you follow what's called the 72T withdrawal rules. 72T withdrawal rules. I won't get into all the specifics on this. It gets rather complicated. I encourage you, if you're concerned about taking money out prior to retirement, don't be. There are many options, and I've just listed three off the top of my head, that allow you to do so to access your money, again, keyword, your money prior to retirement age. Next, There is this myth that I've seen for years, if not at least for decades now, that the, quote, U.S. government is somehow going to take your 401k plan or going to take it away, etc. Guess what? I've been hearing this for years. It's not going to happen, men. If anything, they might restrict it. If anything, they might say, oh, well, you can't put your money in the stock market, etc. But you know what? That's going to be so far in the future. And of course, you can make changes well in advance. You'll know if there's going to be some sort of negative change like that. That should not dissuade you. That should not stop you from today giving till it hurts. Because the biggest reason why you want to max it out is because the 401k is a disciplined automatic savings plan. It gives you a guaranteed savings plan. You put in $18,500 this year into your 401k, you put it into a money market fund, I guarantee you at the end of this year, you will have that $18,500 plus some small rate of interest, period. Now, do that for a period of, oh, let's say 10 years. Oh, well, I can do the math here. I come up with over $180,000 at the end of 10 years. Again, guaranteed men, you can do this. This is a great way that I have achieved, as well as I can tell you, many other men have achieved financial independence at a relatively young age, which I assume is your goal. Quick summary here, men. You need to max out your 401k. You need to give till it hurts. Stop 
walking by the thousands of dollars that's sitting in front of you. You can do this. You can access your money prior to retirement age, contrary to what most people seem to believe. You do not have to put your money in the stock market. Again, contrary to what most people seem to believe, the government is not going to be taking your money, at least not here in the near future. And actually, they are going to be taking it from you if you don't put your money in the 401k because you're going to be paying more in taxes. Men, as always, hit the like button if you found this useful. John Galt, out.